Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So after updating to iOS 26, a lot of users are running into sound problems. Maybe your iPhone speakers are not working, the sound is super low, or you are just not getting any audio at all. Don't worry, I'll have got some easy fixes that should help bring the sound back. Let's dive right into it. Solution 1. Check silent mode and volume. Sound simple, but make sure your iPhone is in not silent mode. Flip the side switch or check that the silent mode in control center. Solution 2. Disconnect Bluetooth devices. Your iPhone might be sending sound to a Bluetooth device you forget about, like AirPods or a speaker. Just go to Settings app. Tap on Bluetooth. And here disconnect any devices. Then check if the sound comes back through your iPhone speakers. Solution 3. Do not disturb. Swipe down to open the control center and here tap on the moon icon. After that check do not disturb is not turned on. If it's on, tap it to turn it off. Do not disturb silences, calls, notifications and sometimes media sound. So make sure it's disabled. Solution 4. Turn off headphone mode glitch. Sometimes after an update, iPhones get stuck in headphone mode even when no headphones are plugged in. To fix this, plug into your headphone and unplug them again or toggle airplane mode on and off. This usually snaps the audio back to the speakers. Solution 6. Reset all settings. If nothing's worked, try restarting your iPhone settings. Don't worry, your photos and apps won't be deleted. Just your system settings will reset. Here's how. Just go to settings app. Then tap on general. Scroll all the way down and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Tap on reset. Then tap reset all settings. Enter your iPhone's passcode. And again tap on reset to confirm your action. After your iPhone's reset, check if the speakers are working again. And that's it. One of these fixes should bring your sound and speakers back to normal on iOS 26. If this video helped you out, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more quick tutorial and iPhone tips. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.